One of the very best features about the Steam Deck is the ability to massively customize the look of the game library in Steam OS. And a whopping 81% of you great viewers on yesterday's community poll right here on the channel voted that yes, you'd also love to customize Army Crate on the ROG Ally in some way too. While customization options are currently limited within Armory Crate, here's how to customize your game artwork from looking something like this to something like this in just four easy steps. So let's dive straight in and for step one, find your C drive, then click view, then go to show, then make sure the hidden items option is ticked. Step two, head to the app data folder, then click local, then scroll down to a folder called packages, then click a folder called b9eced6f.armorycratesc underscore q and a load of other letters and numbers. <laughs> wow, that is a mouthful. That's what she said. <laughs> Michael, please. There he is. Please. There he is. By the way, to make sure you don't miss out on any of these great tutorials, slap that subscribe button and enable notifications. And if you enjoy these videos, then hit like. And if you really enjoy this content, then you can now support the channel by buying a coffee, which would be so appreciated. The link is in the description. You guys rock. Hey, yo. Don't sing it, bring it. Whoa. Oh, hey. What'd you just say, Chico? Uh -oh. Okay, back to this long named folder. Let's now click local state, then game library, then external cover. In here, find the game or app folder that you'd like to change the artwork for, which in my case is Chiaki. Be sure to check out the massive 2.2 Chiaki update tutorial right here on the channel as early indications show that it's a huge improvement over the old 2.1.1 version for many of us, with it being the first Chiaki update in two full years. For step three, let's find our new artwork. There's a fantastic website called steamgriddb.com, link in the description. Simply search for your new game cover or app here, so in our case, Chiaki. Remember we need landscape artwork to use in Armory Crate, so pick any of the artwork you like, and I'm going to select this one, so just click on this small download button on the very bottom right. Double check that it's a PNG file, otherwise the file won't be read properly. This is important, so don't forget this. Next, right click on it, select save image as, and select where to save, which in my case will be the desktop. Here, make sure you shorten the default long name, otherwise it may not be read properly by Armory Crate. Finally, just drag our PNG file we just saved it on the desktop into this external cover folder we already had open. You can of course just try googling artwork instead of using Steam Grid DB. So just use the words PNG and also 1920 by 1080 in the search bar to get the right artwork format. And if you find artwork but not in the PNG format, use the snipping tool that comes free with Windows 11 on the Ally and save it as a PNG like I've done here with this incredible Resident Evil 4 remake artwork. Go crazy guys. So now our artwork is in the correct game or app folder. For the final step four, let's head back to Armory Crate. Here highlight the game or app we need to change, which in our case is Chiaki, and press the X button on the controller. Select edit game info on the bottom left, press edit under the game artwork on the right hand side, and your image should appear, so just select it and press done. 
Return to the game library and it should now be your new custom artwork. Yeah! yeah! A little tip that on Steam Grid DB, you may want to change the file type search to just PNG files. So if you're a little OCD like me, go ahead and customize all of your game artwork exactly as you'd like it. Always remembering two things, that the artwork must be in a PNG file format and ideally in a 1920 by 1080 size format. Leave a link in the comments to any great game or app artwork that you come across either on Steam Grid DB or on Google to share with our other amazing viewers. And as a little extra bonus for watching right to the end of the video, I'd love to share this awesome quote. At the end of the day, what really matters is that your loved ones are well, you've done your best and that you're thankful for all that you have. Many times in life we can feel that whatever we do just isn't good enough. So let's make sure we're always grateful for the small things and stay encouraged today guys. And check this video out if you want to find out how to update the PS Remote Play app Chiaki that I mentioned earlier to this brand new version 2.2 into 7 easy steps. I appreciate every single one of you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.